Imagine a silent giant entering our solar system. Planet Exxon, unseen world lurking beyond Neptune approaches. Its sheer mass, perhaps several times Earth's, distorts space-time. Oceans slosh, atmospheric currents shift, even Earth's axis might wobble. In this video, we explore the science behind Planet X arrival and the potential gravitational shifts on Earth itself. Stay tuned as we dive deep into orbital mechanics, tidal forces, gravitational perturbations, and what cutting-edge theoretical astrophysics suggests could happen when a massive, distant planet makes its presence known. This is not sensationalism. This is rigorous science, hypothetical but grounded in physics. Ready to uncover how Planet X could reshape our world? Let us begin. Section 1, Introduction to Planet X Concept. In the realm of modern astrophysics, Planet X refers to a hypothetical massive body in the far reaches of the solar system. The idea gained traction with observational anomalies in the orbits of trans-Neptunian objects. Astronomers noticed that certain distant minor planets exhibit clustered orbital elements, which some theorists interpret as gravitational shepherding by a large unseen planet. This hypothetical world might have a mass of possibly 5 to 10 times Earth's mass, orbiting in hundreds of astronomical units. The concept is still uncertain and no direct detection has occurred. Nevertheless, it provides a fascinating thought experiment in planetary dynamics. Section 2, Mass, Distance, and Gravitational Influence Gravity obeys Newton's law of universal gravitation and Einstein's general relativity. The gravitational force between two masses decreases with the square of the distance. If Planet X is at 100 astronomical units, its tidal influence on Earth is minimal. But as it moves closer, say within 50 astronomical units or even closer, its uh, gravitational gradient across Earth becomes non-negligible. The tidal force is proportional to the mass of Planet X and inversely proportional to the cube of the distance between centers of mass. Therefore, if Planet X with mass 5 times Earth were at 20 astronomical units, the tidal force scaling could reach values comparable to or greater than the Moon's tidal force at certain points. Section 3. Potential Effects on Earth's Rotation and Axis Tidal torques from Planet X could induce a small but measurable change in Earth's axial tilt. Currently, Earth's obliquity is approximately 23 degrees, 4 minutes, 36 seconds. A migrating massive planet could torque the spin axis, causing precession or nutation shifts. Over timescales of thousands of years, this could alter climate cycles. However, modern geophysics and rotational dynamics suggest that a planet at several tenths of astronomical units might induce only millier second changes per year. Tiny, but cumulative over millennia. Section 4. Ocean Tides, Seismic Loading, and Atmospheric Response Tidal distortion from Planet X would create additional bulges in Earth's oceans and mantle. These bulges could produce tidal stresses in the lithosphere, possibly triggering seismic events in tectonically active regions. The redistribution of massive oceans moving, cross-responding would alter Earth's moment of inertia and therefore rotational speed. Slight changes in day length, measured in milliseconds, could result. The atmosphere coupled to Earth's rotation might shift wind patterns. Jet streams and trade winds could reorganize, affecting weather. Large tidal bulges may also influence the distribution of sea level at different latitudes. Section 5. Orbital Perturbations and Resonance Planet X's gravitational field would perturb the orbits of outer planets Neptune, Uranus, even Saturn. These perturbations could cascade inward via resonant interactions. For instance, minor shifts in Neptune's orbit cause shifts in Pluto's orbital inclination. Over time, chaotic diffusion and orbital resonances could propagate effects toward the inner solar system. The secular perturbation theory predicts that eccentricities and inclinations of planetary orbits evolve due to long-term gravitational interactions. If Planet X crosses a critical resonance zone, the architecture of the solar system could be subtly redesigned. Section 6, Time Scales and Observational Signatures If Planet X is inbound, what time scale are we talking about? At present, unknown, but if it is bound in, a, in an eccentric orbit with perihelion at, say, 30 astronomical units and ophelion at 1,000 astronomical units, its orbital period might be tens of thousands of years. Human scale effects would be gradual. However, as it approaches perihelion, observable anomalies might appear. Slight changes in residuals of spacecraft tracking stations like New Horizons, anomalous perihelion precession of known planets, deviations in the trajectories of long-period comets. Astronomers could detect gravitational signatures before any direct optical or infrared detection. Section 7. Scientific Uncertainties and Limits All modeling rests on assumptions. Mass of Planet X, Orbital Elements, Density, Composition. Hi, family. 
I hope you're enjoying this video. I wanted to take a quick pause to remind you of something super important. A lot of you watch the videos and I love that, but I've noticed there are still some vid people who haven't subscribed to the channel yet, and it's free. If you're one of them, this is the perfect moment. Hit the little button and the bell so you don't miss anything that's coming up. And likes help us a ton to keep growing too. And, well, if you feel in your heart that you want to take it a step further and support the channel, just know that we have some options for those who want to go beyond. You can send a super chat at any time, or if you feel like joining the family, you have the option to become a channel member for a small fee of just 3 euros a month. Any support, no matter how small, is a huge boost to keep creating content for you all. So, subscribe, leave a like, and if you want to and can, lend a hand with a super chat or by joining the channel. Thank you in advance for all your love and for being part of this community. Let's continue with the video. Models use n-body simulations and perturbation theory. Uncertainties in mass distribution, three-dimensional orbit, inclination, eccentricity, all affect predicted outcomes. Current observations of trans-Neptunian object clustering are statistically marginal. Critics argue observational bias may explain clustering. Until a direct detection via telescope or spacecraft occurs, Planet X remains hypothetical. Should such a body exist, the magnitude of Earth's gravitational shifts depends critically on how close and massive it really is. Section 8. Conclusion and Implications for Humanity In summary, if Planet X were to approach within a few tens of astronomical units, its gravitational influence on Earth could manifest as ocean tides beyond lunar tides, minor changes in rotation rate, axis wobble, seismicity, atmospheric pattern shifts. These effects would be subtle on human timescales but scientifically detectable. Over geological time, non-negligible climate forcing might emerge. It is essential to continue long baseline astronomical surveys, search for direct evidence, and refine models. The arrival of Planet X, should it ever happen, would be a dramatic natural experiment and a compelling reminder of our dynamic solar system. If you enjoyed this journey through the cosmos and found the science behind Planet X thought-provoking, please consider giving this video a like. It really helps support the channel and keeps us motivated to create more content that dives deep into fascinating and important topics like this one. Feel free to leave a comment with your thoughts, questions, or theories. We love hearing from you. And don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss an exploration into the unknown. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.